I work probably most mornings till late afternoon. I work Monday through Friday, sometimes on weekends, depending on the size of the job. Um, if I do get a big job, I'll usually work Saturday and Sunday. My name is Jason Subic. I'm the owner of Inked Vision Screen Printing here in Plainfield, Illinois. And to give you an idea of how I got started, I basically did some screen printing in my college years. I decided that that really wasn't the thing for me. I was looking to make a lot of money. So I decided to go to college for computers. And when I graduated, I got out of the college. I moved here to the Chicago area and I got a job working at IBM. I thought that was the greatest thing in the world. I'm working at IBM, I'm wearing a suit, I'm loving it, driving a nice car. But basically, in the computer industry, you're working all the time. I'd get up in the morning, get to work, wouldn't get home till late at night. So it was kind of one of those things, once I had kids, it wasn't really that practical. It was kind of lost its luster. I was no longer at home, I was always working. So that's when I kind of decided maybe I would start my own business. Ooh, I gotta answer this. Hello, this is Jason. screen printing, which is basically all your printed shirts are done with some sort of screen printing process. So that's the route that I took. I had a lot of time to spend with my kids. I could go to all the family functions. It was something you can pretty much, I mean, set your own hours to. The printing industry is a little bit, I mean, for myself, I'm not really a large company. So if I want to print overnight, I can print overnight. I want to print during the day, I could print during the day as long as I got my job set up and I get those done uh, when they're due. You know, everything works okay. I guess my motivation for running this type of business is the flexibility you have. And I do really enjoy artwork. I like making things. I love printing. Printing shirts, everybody needs shirts. It's an easy sell. Um, it's not something that you're trying to sell that nobody really needs. So if you go somewhere, odds are somebody needs shirts. Every business needs shirts, every school needs shirts. Most of the designs I do uh, are customer based. They'll, they'll tell me what they want. I do have a couple online stores where I actually draw up my own uh, images and post those out there. So we do sell some stuff online. Basically to get started in this type of business, I worked for someone else for a while. Um, kind of got a little bit of knowledge that way and then the rest was pretty much learning on your own. I mean, you if you have all the equipment, you can pretty much print anytime you want. I can throw it at the camera. Do it. <laughs> Being an entrepreneur isn't for everyone. I don't think it's something everyone can do. I mean, you kind of have to have the will to set your own hours. I don't know. You can't just not work. I mean, I know a lot of people that they work out of their house or they work out of a local warehouse and they just don't want to do the work. They need somebody telling them, okay, this project is due, you got to do this. If you can't set your own uh, schedule, it's not going to be successful for you. I mean, even though you work for yourself, you still got to put in a lot of time. It's just you got more flexibility on when you put in the time. Restricted area. What's in there? What's in there, Dad? Nothing. Huh? Nothing. <laughs>